Are you considering a trip to Australia, the land down under? If so, I cannot wait to introduce you to Monique. A trip to Australia is on everyone's bucket list for good reason. It really is a beautiful place with so much to see and do. But if you're thinking about going, you're going to want an advocate and travel advisor in your corner, which is why I cannot wait to introduce you to Monique. My name is Jennifer and I'm the owner of Canopy of Stars Travel, a boutique agency specializing in custom curated vacations. If this is your first time here, please drop a hi in the comments below so we can welcome you to our community. And if you've been here before, we would love for you to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you know when we release more information. As I was saying, we have a travel advisor who specializes in Australia. I can't wait for you to meet Monique Randell. Monique, I am so excited you're here because I can't wait for everybody to meet you. Can you kind of introduce yourselves and tell us why did you decide to become a travel advisor? Sure, yes. Um, my name is Monique Brando. Um, I am an assistant principal at a high school and have been for about 11 years and um, looking close to retirement. Uh, I enjoy making people's dreams and excursions come to life and it brings me joy to, to send off a family to St. Thomas like I just did and that's why I'm doing this. It's really fun and exciting and it, it brings me happiness. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, you mentioned things like you are sending people and you help them with excursions, but what else do you do to help your clients when they're booking with Canopy of Stars Travel? Yeah, well, for example, um, that group, um, that family got to the airport and their entire flight was canceled. So I was able no. to help them. Yeah, I was able to help them sort of on the other end while they dealt, you know, countertop with people. But it was nice because I actually rebooked them on an entirely different um, airline and they were able to get there on time to make their excursions. Um, and they were really happy to purchase travel insurance. <laughs> so I helped them with that as well. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, people, we we kind of think when we're traveling that, you know, flight delays and stuff could happen, but they always happen to other people. So it's really <laughs> important when you're traveling to have somebody like you who's really excellent at understanding the nuances, nuances of travel to be able to help rebook them because they could have taken, you know, what the airline was offering but they would have missed the excursions. Yes, three days later. So they were they were happy. <laughs> so I know you I know you talked about uh, St. Thomas, but I know that there's some place that's near and dear to your heart. So where are you specializing in for your travel? Yes. yes. Um, well, I just became an Australian specialist. Um, Congratulations. Thank you. Yes, I have family that migrated from Italy and they've lived there since I was born. Um, so I've been 11 times and <laughs> I have spent Christmases on the beach and exploring Queensland and just the beautiful beaches and the wonderful people in Australia um, makes it really close to my heart. And so, yeah, I'm excited to be a specialist and help people get there. <laughs> that is awesome. So what are some tips or some must things do for people thinking about going to Australia? Yeah, um, it really depends on what you're looking for because Australia has a lot of things to offer. Um, you know, they have hiking in Southern uh, Australia. The beaches of Queensland are beautiful and crystal clear and the Great Barrier Reef is a must see. Um, I've been to the capital, which is a beautiful town. Mm -hmm. Um, but really Sydney Harbor also is just one of those amazing tourist spots that you can't, you can't let that <laughs> go to way, <laughs> go to this wayside, um, but anywhere. And then the other side of Australia, I've actually never been, but getting into it with the, the training was amazing. Mm -hmm. So Perth, Perth, excuse me, has a lot to offer. And so I'm excited if anybody wants to go on that side of the, the gigantic island as well. <laughs> well, we're excited for people to meet you and to get to travel with you also. So one yeah. last question because I'm just terribly curious. Have you been to the Great Barrier Reef? I, you know, it's funny. I have, but not actually in the water. <laughs> so I got okay. to see it from the beach. Um, I know that my mother and my aunt have gone on a tour. Um, like oh, you can wow. get into these boats with clear bottoms. You can snorkel. You can do all of that um, scuba dive. But I know it's amazing. And I've seen my cousin is actually a deep sea fisherman in the past. Mm -hmm. So I would see all the things he would bring home um, sh from sharks to octopus to, you know, puffer fish. Um, so it's just an amazing, they have, I think Australia has the most 
species of animals and insects. And I don't know if you've heard that, but it's, it's an amazing country. <laughs> So when you're driving, are there just kangaroos and koalas around like we would see like deer here in the United States? <laughs> well, they're kind of, yeah, they're kind of like deer. They're not just like wandering around, but there are areas. I've actually fed wild kangaroo from my hand. Oh my gosh. Um, I know the zoos used to let you hold koalas. I'm not sure if they do anymore, but um, yeah, you have to kind of seek them out, but they are, they're pretty amazing to do and see. Yeah. That's awesome. So if you are thinking about going to Australia, you can see Monique not only has experience from being there so many times, she knows the area, but she's also an Australia expert, which is so important when you're planning a trip. Monique, if somebody wants to work with you, what's the best way for them to reach you? Um, you know, email or text. I usually have my phone right next to me would be the best. Um, they can text me probably the fastest response, but either way works for me. Awesome. Thank you so much. Have a great day. And we look forward to hearing all about the trips you have coming up. Okay. Thanks, Jennifer. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. Are you as excited about Australia as we are? If you are, you'll want to reach out to Monique. She'll be able to put together a seamless itinerary with all the best recommendations so you can go truly relax and enjoy this amazing country. I'll leave her information in the description below so you can reach out to her. Until then, I wish you well, I wish you safe and happy travels, and I can't wait to see you under a canopy of stars.